uh, and related to arthritis, it's popping your joints. There are uh, several myths about um, if you should or you shouldn't, or why you shouldn't, or what happens. Basically, uh, it's very simple, actually, in between most or some of the joints, like, for example, your knuckles, uh, there is what we call synovial fluid uh, or synovial fluid which basically is a liquid that's made um, with the purpose of lubrication. So the joints, one bone doesn't uh, have a lot of friction with the other, so there's this liquid. And it's like trapped in a capsule. Uh, so basically when you stretch or you try to pop your knuckles, uh, the bubbles of CO2 that are dissolved in this liquid, basically they create what we call cavitation, which means they enlarge and eventually they pop. So that's what creates the sound. It's not the joint that is dislocating or and nothing is breaking. It's just basically air bubbles that pop. So it's very similar to what happens when you open a bottle of champagne. Basically the bubbles uh, grow and the pressure Pops the cork, so it's it's basically the same. Uh, usually, this will not uh, create any disability, any arthritis, or any pain. Of course, of course, excessive doing of it might create certain uh, tension of your uh, ligaments. So I wouldn't recommend you to do it all the time. But even if you don't do it on purpose, you will notice that eventually, certain times, only once or more, more than once a day, your your joints will pop without you even trying to do it. So it's normal and no, nothing will happen if you do it. 